Greetings, EQOA Revival community. It brings me much joy to announce that we have reached 2,000 members. This truly is a testament to the passion of a community that EQOA has, even five years after its official sunset. In December of 2012, I started a Facebook group called Elder Council for EQOA Revival. The group's charter was to explore official and unofficial ways to revive EQOA. Later, this group transformed into the group you know as EQOA Revival. Let me tell you, in the beginning, we had nothing, absolutely nothing, except for a dream and these useless disks of the EQOA client. Over the years, we sought out our long-lost EQOA brothers and sisters in hopes of keeping the community together. We also scoured the community for the talent needed to resurrect the game. Despite a healthy amount of doubt, the EQOA Revival Project has overcome some serious hurdles, things that some said could never be done. It is through sheer willpower and passion that this project continues. I, I know for some of you, this process may seem like a super slow motion version of video game development. The truth is, the individuals who contribute their time are few and have jobs and families and lives to live and maintain. They don't receive any financial compensation for their work, only a personal level of satisfaction. In a lot of ways, this development is about the journey rather than the destination. For those of you with doubts, or if because you're not seeing a lot of updates in a given time period, you start to feel like this isn't going to happen, let me kindly point out that this project goes through waves of progress and periods of apparent quiet. It will seem like nothing is happening and then suddenly there will be an explosion of many updates. This has been going on for nearly five years. EQOA can't be compared to any other project. No one has ever reverse engineered a console based MMORPG before. Where we are with this project is against all odds and when it is complete, it will be a miracle. For everyone waiting in the meantime, we thank you for your ongoing support and patience. We know it can be excruciating at times. We know what it means to want to go home, and there isn't a way to get there. And while no one here can simply offer a guarantee that this project will be completed in a specific way, after carefully looking under the hood, we believe it can be done. It really is only a matter of time, so hang in there. On a personal note, this project is immensely important to me. I wake up every day thinking about it. Even when I'm going through my very busy life, I'm constantly conceptualizing what aspect of this project I need to work on, which has resulted in me having eggs in many EQA baskets. This compounded with the fact that I get a fraction of the time in my real life that I wish I could spend on the project. It tends to leave seemingly unfinished pieces lying around, but I simply just do my best. I know I'm a lifer for this project. I'll be around to the end. I do have a couple of announcements. Uh, the first one is directed at the entire community to get involved in. EQA Revival needs a rebranding. We're going to need a new name when the game is up and running. Let me be really specific here. We can't call this project EverQuest Online Adventures Revival. Like Project 1999, we need to have something that doesn't have EverQuest in the name. So it's possible that we could change the name entirely, and alternatively, it's possible that we could keep EQA Revival, but the acronym EQOA has to stand for something else. Sony, SOE, Daybreak, uh, they don't own EQOA, the acronym itself. I bet if we all put on our thinking caps, we could come up with a better name, whether it's totally new or a repurposing of the acronym. There isn't any rush to this, but it would probably be a good idea to sort this out this year. In fact, we will set a long polling schedule so as to increase the chances of getting the best name. There will be multiple stages to this that we will detail out in another post. But essentially, there will be a rename the game slash project poll, and then once it's decided, we will ask the artists in the community to transform the new name into a nice visual logo, which will go through another stage of voting. So put your thinking caps on. Myself and Cody Hamby will be coordinating the efforts here and at the Reunited page, so keep a lookout for posts about that. The second topic is that there have been a number of you who have reached out to help on the non-programming side of things. My personal apologies if you felt ignored. Life has been overwhelmingly busy for me the last couple months. I am formulating a new site group dedicated to catching all of you non-programmers that want to help. 
In this new group, we will have resources and topics to coordinate on for the revival of EQOA. I'm excited to have some new energy join the project. For those of you who have offered to help, I'm going to track each of you down and invite you to this new group. What's that? Why make another Facebook group, you ask? <laughs> another EQOA Facebook group? Uh, as strange as it sounds, this revival group um, is for official project news, as well as technical assistance, and also so that we can scoop up any project helpers and get them on the right path. We've learned that we kind of need to keep the jibber-jabber off this page so that important info can be more easily found. If you leave a post that never posts or eventually gets deleted, this is why. Please don't take it personally. We want you to connect with the community, but we kindly ask that you head over to EverQuest Online Adventures Reunited and talk about EQA to your heart's content there. Think of these two groups as twin parts of the EQA community. Reunited is Freeport. Revival is for project discussion. Just to clarify, our development doesn't happen here. It happens elsewhere. Please don't scroll through the Revival page and assume that the project is dead. We really only post the big stuff here. All right, so that's all I have for today. Congratulations, EQA community on 2,000 members. Please stay tuned for more rebranding info as well as invitations for project helpers. Lastly, a very big thanks to all of EQA's contributors, each of you who have sacrificed pieces of your personal time to make this dream a reality. Peace.